some DIY and tidying the living room. Hi, my name is Sharon and welcome to my channel. I'm so happy you're here and I hope you stay for the whole video. Today I'm working on our living room and I'm just doing a little bit of Christmas decorating and a little bit of cleaning and this is Tiny Tiny Tuesday. So I hope you enjoy this video and welcome, welcome any new subscribers and a big YouTube hug out to all my regular subscribers. Thank you. I really, really do appreciate you. So this morning I was sitting having my cup of coffee and I thought, I know what I want to do with certain things. So I made up the stuff for the top of my coffee table. I made up a little candle arrangement and then a little arrangement with some birds. And then underneath, I put my dough bowl with my um, vintage ornaments in them with a little bit of greenery. And I'll show you all that in this video. And I'm just going to do a little bit of tidying because it is Tiny Tidy Tuesday. So, going to make a little decoration to sit on top of the three books that I thrifted for my coffee table. And I have these little candle trees, which I think are just adorable. Which is the same as what I have in this decoration, which I'll show you in a bit. I think I'm going to keep them the same. And just snip pieces off of this and put it around. And I have little pine cones that I'm going to add. And I think that will just look really sweet right there. So, welcome to my channel. My name is Sharon. And it is Tiny Tidy Tuesday. And if you're new here, thank you, thank you for clicking on my video. And I hope you enjoy this. I'm going to DIY a few Christmas decor pieces for my living room. And I'm going to tidy up a bit in my living room for Tiny Tidy Tuesday. And Sunday dawn, I sure hope you're taking time to rest and feeling better for when you come back. We all look forward to that. There will be a playlist in my comments. And all you have to do is click on it and you can see all the other tiny, tidy people who are continuing with this collaboration because we find it so helpful in our homes to have this on our schedule. I do, anyhow, for sure. So here I'm just starting off with a glass riser and a mirror that I've had for a while. And I'm just giving everything a good clean so it all shines really pretty. So we'll watch me make this little piece of decor. Well, I wasn't sure how this mirror, the back of the mirror was going to stick to the glass, but it did. It stuck to the glass very well. So I really like to add a piece of glass into the decor because it just makes everything all shiny and sparkly. And I think it looks really pretty. Well, I had some fun putting these candles on here because the candles are real candles, they're wax. And, of course, the glue gun kept melting them, so <laughs> I probably could have just left the glue off and melted the wax and put it on the mirror. But finally, I got them all on there. Okay. 
So here I'm just adding in some pine needles. That's what I call them, long pine needles. And I'm just adding them in between the candles. And it just adds that little extra texture you need to make it look a little more complete. As I just showed you a little pine cone, now I'm going to just add a few little pine cones in and around the candle trees. These candles were a gift from my daughter last year, so I'm using them of course this year. And I really, really do like them. And I think this made a very, very pretty decoration for my coffee table to sit on top of those thrifted books. This is the little iron stand that I bought and a little basket and I sprayed it black. And I think I'll turn this bird this way so that we have one facing us when we're sitting on the bird. I'm going to put plaid on my tree and I'm going to put woodland animals and birds. So I thought I'd add the birds into this. A little bunch of berries. And so we'll give you a good view. We have the same pine needles as we do with the candles. So it all comes together. Go. Okay. So that's the top of our coffee table. I think it looks rather pretty and festive for the season. So when you sit when you sit on the couch this is what you see. Minus the laundry basket. <laughs> and it has all my antique, all my old decorations that were passed down in the family. And so let's get those sprigs put in there. I think I'm going to start. I'm going to put this stuff. This is what I'm going to make my lovely bouquet out of. I don't know if it'll be in this video or not. Hopefully. And I have a few pieces laying around that I've used in other stuff. I probably won't use it in this. But I have my glue gun. And I have some arms covered all up. But first, I think I'm just going to do a little bit of picking up. We have some, I have some newspapers over here. This goes on David's table because it says Charlie Brown Tree. We'll just stick it back here until it's time to put it up. Let's tidy up this table a little bit. I don't need to do too much. And of course, it all needs to be dusted and cleaned. But that's for another video, not this one. Okay, we've just got these that need to go in recycling. Need to go on the dirty clothes, David's sandals, 
I think we'll put them over here by his chair. And I have this little bit of laundry that I'm going to fold and put away. So, that's going to sit here on my couch. <laughs> this is my bath mat for the bathrooms. Oh, that's my niece's. <laughs> she gave me Swiss char in it. It was very good. <clears throat> okay, it's mainly just face clothes and towels. So, we'll just fold them up. And I hope everybody's doing good and thinking about getting ready for Christmas, if that's your choice of holiday. If not, whatever you celebrate, I hope you're thinking about it and enjoying it. <coughs> I always enjoy I always enjoy doing the decorating for the seasons and Christmas I do the most I guess <clears throat> I was I was raised a Catholic and I found the Baha'i faith and now I'm a Baha'i and I celebrate Christmas because of my Christian background and all my Christian family so, and let's camera's crooked. And of course, being an influencer on YouTube, people look forward to seeing what we do for Christmas for our decor. But I've always celebrated Christmas. And yes, I do believe in Jesus. Okay, let's get these towels folded. There's not too much stuff here. It's just a little bit of leftovers from one of my laundry loads. I've got tons of laundry downstairs to do. And I'll probably start it today, I guess. I don't know, it's kind of late in the day already. I've been very, very tired with my chronic fatigue because I'm doing so much. That's okay. Okay. I'll have a little, we'll just take this and put it in the hallways of the living room. And this area here needs just a little bit of tidying. This stuff in my craft room. That stuff on the floor I'm going to use. It's my water. This whoop, that goes in my craft room. This goes in my nice clean bin, which I'm very pleased to say is still organized and clean. <laughs> That's good. Oh, I think I'll put this. I can put this. This is Rusty's collar. No, it should go by the door, because when we go to take him out, we're going to wonder where the collar is. So I'm going to throw it over there to the door. Good stuff. This is my eyeglass cleaner. And I have some pencils and pens. And I have out. I'll put them in the proper bin. And some earrings to put away. This goes in my makeup case. This is a nail file. So we're going to put it in with the nail stuff. Yeah, this system might work. <laughs> and I have my big water jug. And my coffee from this morning that I drank already. Okay. So, I need a home for my drum. Maybe I'll just keep it on my table. I keep saying I'm going to learn to play it, but 
I don't know, every so often I bang around on it. <laughs> Let's put it up there for fun. Okay, I got that in my stocking when you're for Christmas for my son. Okay, that looks better. Okay. Well, I'm going to go put this stuff away. And I'll be right back. It is time to tidy up the living room. All this stuff. My cushions out. Let's pick up this stuff. <laughs> All the stuff that goes in the crafter in the bag of bags. See that goes in there. This is garbage, 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 garbage. Scissors, wire cleaners, knife. Good. This is garbage. And there's lots of stuff on the floor that's going to get vacuumed, just not today. And turn it off because it does get hot. And this is a bit more stuff. In the bathroom. Spray this. <sighs> because this is where I've been working. Oh darn moss. It stains stuff if you're not careful. Certain brand. I need my table and it's looking green. Wow, I don't like that. Hopefully it won't come off. Yep, it did. Thank goodness. Thank goodness. Okay, I'm waiting for that to dry. And this goes in the kitchen, this goes in the kitchen. Oh, I still got most of my coffee. Can't waste that. in there because the garbage is in the kitchen. Just cut the big stuff off the floor. Okay, now I'm going to bring my books up. Get a little dust. And I'm going to separate them out a little bit so that you see all the colors. Kind of like that. And the little candles on top. And the basket and birds. Okay. This was thrifted and the basket was thrifted. I had the greenery for years and I bought the berries last year and I bought the birds this year. The candles were a gift from my daughter. I thrifted the little um, riser, glass riser. I bought it at a thrift store. And the little mirror I had in my drawer in the bathroom. So, that kept that nice. And, as I said, underneath... We have the vintage ornaments. So, I'll put this stuff where it belongs. Okay, call that my tiny tiny. Let's I'll be right back. Okay. 
Okay, well, we got a few little things done, which is great. The best thing I did today was doing my setting up some of my decor in my living room for Christmas. And I, um, I have the spot cleaned out where the tree is going to go. So that's my tiny tiny for this Tuesday. I hope you enjoyed seeing me make my little decorations for around the living room. I know I have lots of fun doing them. And um, you will see more when we do the Christmas home tour. So, thanks again for watching. And don't forget to subscribe, please. And give me a big thumbs up if you like this video. So, we'll see you in my next video, which will be Fairy Garden Thursday. Bye!